How's it going everyone and welcome to another anime figure unboxing review kind of thing. This is going to be our second one here on the channel whose name I haven't 100% ironed out. I think it's Redazone Japan right now. So basically I already filmed the intro to this once and it turned out really bad. In fact, it turned out that I had some stuff on my mustache. It made me look like I was really messy. I think it was just like a fuzz or something, but you couldn't tell that it was a fuzz. So, long story short, we're doing this again, and I've actually already opened up the figure. In fact, astute viewers can see her in the background. She looks fantastic, but we're gonna get a much closer view of her. Uh, she is Takao from, no, this is the wrong side. Takao from Arpeggio of Blue Steel. And as you can see, she's a fairly, cultured figure not super cultured but fairly cultured the skirt <laughs> is removable the skirt is removable but um we're just gonna we're just gonna leave just gonna leave that on her for now um this figure i bought actually from amiami Ami, and it was on sale it was only about 70 dollars, and normally it's about 140 140 150 and so with shipping i paid like 90 bucks or something for it which is a pretty good price for this figure. This is going to be a pretty short video. You can probably already see the, the time down below, but I think she's really nice looking and uh, she's probably going to be, you know, a, one of the figures that I just keep up there. And just, she looks sweet, man. I'm not super familiar with the anime. I was just actually looking at figures that were on sale and uh, I kind of looked into it a little bit. It has to do with like battleships and that kind of stuff. Maybe kind of like Azure Lane, but not really like Azure Lane. Though I think it's funny that both Arpeggio of Blue Steel and Azure Lane both uh, allude to blue. In any case, any case, she looks great. So we're gonna open up this figure and take a look at her. And also, we got a new, we got a new little comic from Ami Ami. A little, little, little manga comic here from Ami Ami, like we got in the last one. So you can kind of, I'm not blocking anything, am I? Nope. So you can kind of look at that and, and read that as well. But without further ado, let's take a look at that figure. Um, I do plan on doing a future video where I talk about all the figures I have pre-ordered because we're probably gonna get, you're probably gonna have at least one figure video a month for the next few months. Well, not actually, not next month, but going forward after that, we're gonna have a lot of figures. Um, <laughs> And they're really exciting. There's some really expensive ones. I think we'll do a full video going over all of the pre-orders very soon. So anyway, thank you for watching this video. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. And let's get on to um, Takao from Arpeggio of Blue Steel. So here is Takao in her completed glory. She's from an anime called Arpeggio of Blue Steel. Not something I'm exactly familiar with, so if you have seen this anime, please let me know, and let me know if it's any good. I do like her hair up here. I think it's really cool. Look at that little, like the swirly bit on the top. Really, really nice. This is a very, very nice figure. Um, I don't regret paying 70 bucks for this at all. The hair is not super stiff, which I think is pretty cool. Um, you know, you can see it kind of bending. I don't want to bend it too much. Um, just really, really high quality. Lots and lots of details. The skirt is like a separate piece. Let's see if I can, with one hand, move it. It's like a separate piece. Um, and also the, the hat comes off too, which is cool. So you can have her with hat and without hat. The hat itself has these little ribbons on the back, which um, you can use to, you know, hook it right in place. Very, very nice. This is a cow from Arpeggio of Blue Steel. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below for this figure. Like I said, just a, a very, very good figure. Only those of true culture can appreciate a figure of this caliber. And the stand is actually pretty nice. It's not just like a plain white stand. It does have a, um, you know, a moniker from the anime. It says to cow on it. Really, really nice. Just overall very nice. I know there are two versions of this. This is the uh, white sailor version, and I do believe there is a darker um, clothing version. But um, yeah, really nice. This is going to be a very short video. Very, very short video, but once again, very nice figure. If you can pick this up for, like I said, 70 bucks, I think it is just a, an absolute steal, and she will look fantastic on our shelf. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, everyone, and we will see you next time for some more anime stuff. Yep. <laughs> See you then.